Welcome back students. I hope you had a good time with those bags. I saw some of your videos out there kicking my ball bags. I love it. Today we are going to learn how to do ball bags. That's right. We're going to do Ziploc bags today. You think, how do you think I'm going to do that? Well, I'm going to show you. So what you're going to do is you're going to take one of your Starbucks straws, any kind of straw. You're going to make sure it's sealed tightly. Then you're going to stick the straw in. You're going to blow. You might want to ask your mom and dad. And slip it right out. So you have a Ziploc bag. You can also make a sandwich size bag. So let me show you to do that one too. So. Stick it in, make sure you zip lock tie it. And then I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do with it. It might take more than one time. It's not always. Try not to go lightheaded. Okay, so now you have two bags. I have two Vanna Whites, or Mr. White and Vanna White, that are ready to. So, Mason, can you show us the first bag? He's going to practice catching it with himself. Ready? Good job. Again, throw it up. Good job. Mia has one. Mia, show us your little one. Mia's got a tiny little sandwich bag. Show us Mia. And she practices catching. Whoop. Can you guys practice kicking the sandwich bag? Oh, can you drop? Oh, there you go. Can you kick it? Mom, can you have this? You can have that one. You can show them how to do it that one. Okay, let me see. Good job. So, I just want to show you guys different ways at home how to practice your gross motor, stay moving, simple stuff around the house, um, alongside with... Uh, Kicking Staying moving, kicking, and you guys have a great, great day today.